In this video, we're taking a look at a very underrated DLC weapon, the TAR-21, aka the Tempest Razorback. I have a no recoil class setup that is literally a melt machine. So I'm gonna drop an MGB nuke and I know you guys can do the same. So if you guys enjoy, drop a like in the video, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications. And without further ado, y'all, let's get into it. All right, let's go and take a look at the no recoil laser gun, the TAR-21, aka the Tempest Razorback. This weapon is amazing if you build it properly. Now, for the first attach, we are going to rock the ERGX1. Now, normally, I'd recommend rocking that FLT22 to bump up that sprint to fire speed and aim down sight speed. But this is going to be a better attachment, increasing the recoil control. because people out a lot easier at longer ranges. Now, for the tuning, we are going to be bumping up that sprint to fire speed some more at negative 0.23 and aim down sight speed at negative 0.65 a very good attachment and tune combo here we are not rocking a comb we simply don't have enough attachment slots for this and we're also skipping over the stocks these are not going to be helping us out and overall this is going to be more of a long range setup now we are going to rock an optic and the Cronin mini pro is going to be a fantastic choice giving us that blue dot sight and overall making those long range engagements a hell of a lot easier to go ahead and tackle for the tuning, we are going to be increasing just the aim down sight speed to negative 0.97, a very easy attachment to tune. Now, we're going to be skipping over the laser. These are completely irrelevant on this build, but we are going to rock a barrel, and that 18-inch TAC-2L is going to be the way to go. Some people like to go ahead and put on the 17-inch, but I simply do not like the 4 times optic. It doesn't work well with this AR. This is going to give us everything we need, damage range, hip fire accuracy, bullet velocity, and more movement speeds so we can run around and still have that long range capability. For the tuning, we are going to be bumping up that aim down sight speed some more at negative 0.13 and more recoil steadiness at plus 0.15 to kind of correct that recoil con, putting air quotes around con this attachment does give us now for the muzzle we are going to utilize the echolus 80 here overall a great attachment so we can run around their spawn build a quick and easy streak and drop those mgb nukes sound suppression bullet velocity damage range recoil smoothness you can't go wrong with this now for the tuning we are going to be bumping up that velocity some more at plus 0.68 and more recoil smoothness at plus 1.04 overall a fantastic attachment and tune combination and then finally, we are going to go ahead and utilize an underbarrel, and the Commando Foregrip is going to be great on this weapon, smoothing out that recoil pattern, overall making sure we can move out at very long ranges incredibly easily. Now, for the tuning, we are going to be increasing that aim walking speed at negative 0.4, and more stabilization at plus 0.44. Overall, a great attachment to combo, just going to make sure we can move out at long ranges without a problem. Now, once you go ahead and jump in the firing range, we still have a quick ADS and <laughs> literally like all my class setups y'all you can guarantee to have a very easy to use assault rifle now for many of the build we are going to go ahead and rock with the f tac siege in its submachine gun configuration sir 160 rear grip the 72 round drum the nst 81 barrel the fgx the 70 laser and the siege wire stock here you don't have to tune any of these attachments we're rocking the stun grenade proximity mine and for the perks we are running double time scavenger resupply and quick fix overall a fantastic loadout to use and then finally for the field upgrades we have pro enabled with munitions box and dead silence let's go ahead and this weapon a try the tempest razorback aka the tar 21 is a very solid and i would say underrated ar in season four loaded update if you guys tear it up let me know down in the comment section and as always drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel turn those post notifications let's get into gameplays drop that right there because we already know they're gonna come from that way yeah, he's getting chased by a shotgunner where are these guys at Right, UAV. Switching max. UAV online and opening the AO. I guess there's another one. Planting mine. We'll let the Betty do the work there. Let's go, baby. Okay, the next hard point. Get ready. Keep this moving. Hard point. Secure the Overwatch helo ready for charge. 
Dude, buddy for real has a decoy down. That is unbelievably sketchy. Let's get up here. Oh man. Get this down over in this corner. Alright, which way are they gonna come from? Loading. Friendly Wilson online. They gotta come from this way. Alright, we got the advanced. Let's keep it moving, y'all. This map is kind of interesting. Ever since. I'm not gonna lie, ever since season like four reloaded, I, I feel like this map has gotten like kind of slow paced like I need mags. But like not that many people really be moving around on this board as much as they used to which is kind of annoying because thank you teammate this used to be such a fast paced map and now I feel like it ain't yeah that was a uh... That was unfortunate right there. They got a counter UAV up or whatever they had down. Changing mag. Blood for blood. Reloading. UAV. This isn't chalk yet. We still got time. Like we legitimately still have time here. Oh yeah, we still have time here. Oh yeah, we still got time here. Oh, oh, oh man. That's the advanced joint. Alright, he's on top. Come on, come on, come on, come on, reload. I don't want to call in my my streak just yet. Target down. An armor piercing. Reloading. Requesting closer. Vandal three one inbound. Weapons hot. Enemy overhead. Taking effective fire. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. Location recon. A three spotted. Enemy sensor. I don't have time for that. Loading. We definitely have time to get this nuke. For sure. Is this guy on top? He is. We got time to drop. We oh my god. If he would have fired that gun, I would have died. Okay, now I'm kind of nervous. I'll take this way. Enemy down. Friendly cluster mine set. Changing mags. Enemy personnel at the hard point. We've got them on the run. Rotate over here. They should be over here, right? Uh. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Switching max. This is fucking terrible. Point. Stand by. Enemies 
Drop that here. there. The hard point. Okay, there is somebody underneath here. You got it. You know what? I honestly, I was not trying to. I knew this guy. Yeah, I knew he potentially had a sniper. I was like, bro, I'm not about to try to challenge somebody and, and just get fucking sniped. Thank God we got that. Let's go, baby. 61. All right, so we can... Taking effective fire. Jesus, bro. You know what? I need to... You know, give me this hurric. No, 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 no. Come on, game. God. Like, let me give me this. Let me give this hurricane. Let me get this hurricane. The hurricane is so underrated. I need to make a video on the hurricane, man, because that gun is just. That gun always makes me smile whenever I run it. Put it over here. Keep it moving, man. Excuse me? Yo, how many of them are in the damn hill? Dude, there's like 40 of them in the hill. Literally. Oh, we gotta overwatch. Right, he blew up the betty. Okay, here they come. Let's reload this thing because I think the spawns are about to get pretty interesting. I want to catch as many of them as possible trying to rotate out because... Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Or maybe they're spawning back here. Are they spawning back there? Oh gosh, man. I'm not 100% sure where they're spawning at. They, they should not be spawning in the back of the map, though. got the advanced joint they are spawning in the back of the map why are they spawning in the back of the map back there i don't think they should be spawning like that getting some good melts here though what the hell are they getting overwatch helo who is gone who's on streaks on their team i'm out here just destroying them right now misread my UAV. I really want to know who got streaks on their team, man. We got somebody that's not playing. I'll take that hurricane. The overwatch is gone. Literally, the only reason why I died is because that damn overwatch. Because I couldn't move how I wanted to move, and I was forced to stay in that building. Ended up getting taken out because of that shit. I gotta rebuild my streak, which is cool because the game is... Not over, but still incredibly irritating. Locating the next hard point. Oh, UAV. I'm at the X. Changing mags. Hard point relocated. Secure the target area. Up 
Shit underneath me. Okay, they're all spawning back over here. Oh shit! Nice. Nice little wall bang. I'm actually gonna have to put that there. Uh, we're we're burning them up right now. But yeah, we're burning these guys up right now. I'm not trying to get too hasty. Where's the new the hill? That new hill needs to be on us. Hard point compromised. Otherwise, Secure we will be in trouble. Rotate this way. Buddy's Enemy underneath. You gotta bust that hill, teammate. Alright, we got it. Don't matter. I was gonna be like, teammate, you gotta break that hill because we are running out of time, but in our reality, it don't matter now. Alright. We're kind of in a good spot to try to build up a nice little burner right now because... I don't know. If they get to 230, we gotta drop. Or like at least like 240, we gotta drop. Yeah, we gotta drop. All right. Well, I mean, at least we had the nuke as a backup. Because <laughs> if we didn't have the nuke, we would have lost for sure. Because my teammates just they weren't there. Yeah, if we didn't have the nuke, that that would have been tragic, for real. We would have lost the game. Damn, that would have sucked. Ooh, I'm burning these guys up again. Let's go, baby. Woo, 65.